As part of the challenges of today's world with supply chain management, a lot of our customers are dealing with interruptions in supply chain with vendors not even being able to supply product, being able to quickly then change to a different vendor that can also supply that product. So our customers that are using DCOM as part of that process, what they're doing is they're actually identifying all potential vendors and certifying those vendors for the products that they may be able to supply. So in this example here for this item, we have two vendors that actually could supply the product. Now, one of those vendors is actually our preferred vendor. So this is the vendor that we rely on that can, you know, most of the time provide the product that we need and the quantity that we need. So we mark them as a preferred vendor. But what we also can do is set up any additional vendors that may be able to supply that product. We also can put in approval dates as far as when the certification for that vendor may expire within the system. And then what we're able to do as we plan for our requirements using the built-in material requirements planning tool within the DCOM software, we can identify, first of all, who our preferred vendor is, as we contact them and decide whether or not they can supply our suggested quantity of 9,150, as they get back to us and tell us that they cannot, we can very easily, right from the screen, view the additional vendors. As you'll see here, as we have those two vendors supplied, and we can actually select the additional vendor that can supply us that product. So being able to very quickly change from one preferred vendor to an additional vendor that can then supply us our products makes it very easy for our customers to choose that vendor and get the product that they need in time to produce the product that they're looking to sell to their customers.